Okay, so before I start the video, I just want to say uh, something. If you don't want to watch this video and you just want to, you know, get the code right away and just get shit done, I have a GitHub repository where uh, I store the code in today's video. And you can just copy that or, I mean, some people just look at code and they know what to do. So if you want to just take a look at that and you don't want to, you know, watch the whole video, then yeah you can do that if you want to hear me explain thoroughly like what i'm doing uh for the whole process then you know I, then you, you can watch the video but you know the code is right here main.py uh everything you need to import is in the requirements.txt file just all you need to do is just install this stuff and import the modules uh, accordingly of course but yeah that's all um, another thing is join the discord that's all I usually just say that every single video but can't stress it enough join the discord link in the description and uh, yeah you can you can uh, you know send your bot over to the to the discord get a couple more servers including mine of course um you can also receive help on coding especially the the videos that i've done if you have any problems uh here in this video if i did anything that confuses you or something like that just go just head over to the discord and go to the coding channel and You'll receive your help. A lot of a lot of the people in this Discord are uh, they're good with Pillow. Maybe not necessarily with a uh, byte conversion, but I don't know. Uh, anyways, let's get into this video. So we're gonna go to the API documentation, and as you can see over here, in order to give a webhook an avatar, we need it to be converted to bytes the image of course uh, what we're gonna do is convert ctx.guild.url into bytes I've already tested it out of course and it works so uh, yeah we're gonna convert that into bytes and this is just to verify that we actually did I guess you can consider this a uh, webhook tutorial but kind of isn't it's just like a pillow tutorial but you know take it however you want to as long as I'm helping pe helping you and uh, you gain something out of this anyways um let's get straight into it I'm just gonna close brave okay all right let's zoom in actually just a little bit okay that should be good okay so now that we have our variable URL equals ctx.guild.icon URL which is basically what we're gonna be using to uh, give the webhook its avatar profile picture uh, basically we want the webhook to be the same as this this icon over here so Let's 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 actually get into it for the fifth time. Anyways, another variable we're gonna be creating is icon. Icon equals uh requests dot get URL. Uh, you want to import requests, of course. I think it comes with Python. If it doesn't come, then you can just do pip install requests, and hopefully that works. But yeah, um. Next up, we're going to be creating another variable, a lot of variables in this, um, img, which is image of course, equals uh, image.open. Um, you need to install pillow of course, um, and then once you've installed it, pip install pillow, you do from pil in capital, capitalized import image uh, yeah it's it's different from 
the way you import it isn't exactly the same as when you install it if that makes any sense but next up you need to uh, import bytes IO from IO the IO module um, so you know if you have all that installed you should be good and if you have this imported then we should be good for today's video uh, just listen carefully um, so what we're gonna do here inside of the the parentheses bytes IO and we're making another uh, brackets and inside this we're gonna do icon dot content and we're gonna read that content so we're gonna do mode equals R okay so now that you've done that you're gonna make another variable of course <laughs> uh, this isn't very asynchronous is it but bytes IO Make sure you have the S there. A lot of people do byte IO on mistake. Um, now we're gonna do image.open. Um, image.open B. Wait, is it image.open? No, it's not. Image.save. IMG.save. Yeah, my bad. So this is the variable. We're just gonna save this. So img.save and we're gonna put, put b here as a parameter and we're gonna put uh, the file type. I usually just put uh, format equals jpeg and that usually just works fine for me. And uh, yeah, that's basically it to be honest. Uh, we just do b, b value which basically just means bytes value and we're gonna do b.get value and now that we've done that I'm gonna create another variable of course just a bunch of variables uh, but for this um, we're basically already done you can just do print uh, b underscore value and it'll print out the bytes but for the people that actually want to create a webbook and verify that it works uh, you of course need discord pi and stuff like that but i'm assuming that you know some of you have it but anyways we're just gonna verify um show you guys that it's actually bytes and yeah okay so we're gonna create another variable called channel we're gonna create we're gonna get a discord channel so there's a channel in my discord server called called TL okay we're going to get that channel so what we're gonna do is iterate for ctx.guild.channels and then we're gonna specify the name of the channel the channel name is TL we're talking about this channel over here and we're gonna create a webhook inside of it now that we have gotten the channel what we're gonna do is await channel dot create webhook name equals we're just gonna make the name the same name as the guild the server name basically we're gonna make an f string and we're gonna do ctx dot guild dot channel okay no not not channel jeez name ctx dot guild dot name and what we're gonna do now is avatar equals um, b value b underscore value. Okay, so um, that's what that's what we're gonna do once we invoke the webhook command on Discord, and let's hope for the best. So I'm just gonna save save everything. We're gonna open up the file and. Windows uh, terminal uh, Now we're gonna CD into tests so we're gonna CD into the tests folder tests and We're gonna run the code Python tests dot pi Okay, so uh Discord is already open. Let's just wait for the online, the online thing. 
Is it not working? I have an event here set up. Uh, oh, it, it's online now. Okay. So let's invoke the command. Of course. Um, what we're gonna do is webhook. And if we head and if we head over to channel settings instead of the TL channel. And we go to integration, so you'll see that there is one webhook. And as you can see, it, it has the guild name. And it also has the, uh, the guild icon as its avatar. So yeah, we have converted it to bytes and we, act we actually used the bytes we got to create an avatar. So, pretty simple. Um, this isn't some crazy wacky Python code, but hopefully I helped people and uh, yeah, that's all there is to it. Yeah, GitHub repository will be inside of the description. Join the Discord. Um, follow me on GitHub if you want. I usually have some open source uh, educational repositories. Maybe, maybe in the future I'll make more, but I have, a, I have a couple, so if you want to check that out, you know, you can just search up CLDRK on GitHub and stuff. But yeah, um, yep. Thanks for watching.